Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. Gross! Mm. We did it! We totally we did it, girls! Poutine! I don't even know what to say. <gasps> no way! Did you grow these, Christina? Um, yep. You grew these potatoes. Yep. In the dirt. So the trick is you gotta cut all these fries the same. Right? Okay. Yep. Fries are actually very tricky, aren't they? And what else do we do to the fries? Soak them. We soak them in water. Yep. And we... Deep fry them twice. Double deep fry them. Yep. Is this your contribution to the poutine? Yes, so. You get to eat it on clean plates? Thank you. Wow. Cool. And there it is, the little stack. It's gonna keep growing. Hey, I see one really big one. That's way too big. This one? Yeah. This two. Okay. Then I forgive you. Great. And how come you're not helping us at all? I am helping a lot. How are you helping? I'm working up an appetite. It looks like you're <laughs> <laughs> It looks like you're helping yourself. Yes, I am doing that too. That looks like a 243 ammo belt. Mm -hmm. Oh man, a thing of beauty. You've been building quite a few, hey? Yes. They are gorgeous. But I kind of think that you should help us make poutine. I'm helping with the poutine by making it so that I will really enjoy the poutine. Maybe you're just helping us by just kind of staying out of the way. Dad! It'd be really helpful, Julia, if you just went and sat in the corner for a bit. What? <laughs> Can we go smoke that now? Yes. Let's go. You don't want to be late to the smoker. No, absolutely. Oh man. I just... Want to eat ham? I just feel like I'm a better man for making ham. <laughs> we have never made poutine, but we've eaten poutine and it's fabulous. I think this is gonna be amazing because we happen to be making poutine on ham smoking day. Ooh, that is a lot of fries. Yep. Are we gonna be able to eat all those fries, do you think? No. No? <laughs> do you think we'll need Dave and Shoshana and the boys to help? I think Dave would be sufficient. <laughs> That's all, that's all it would take is Dave. <laughs> uh, this is artwork. It is. Just wait till you guys see me eat them. It will also be artwork. Yeah. <laughs> Rose, are you excited? Yes. This is Rose's homemade pork stock. Yeah. We are making gravy. Let's go. Okay. Look at the Blaze King. We got that Blaze King cranking so that we can make gravy on it. Ah. Oh my. Look at that. It's like jelly. <laughs> oh yeah. That's what we needed. We cooked down all the bones that were, not all of them. We cooked down a lot of the bones that were left over from butchering a pig. And we got this jelly-like pork stock. 
Pretty great. Here, let me help you. You better go check the smoker. Oh yeah. This is the most amazing. And the secret ingredient. Fresh cheese curd. Sarah made this yesterday, right? Two days, uh, two two days, days ago. ago, so it's still very fresh. And it is, here, you can try one. I... Did you? <laughs> try, tell me how it is. Mm. What does it taste like? Like cheddar cheese. I don't know, we don't know what type of cheese curd you're supposed to make for poutine. So we just made like normal cheese curd. And you know what? It's going to be amazing. Yeah. Are you so excited? Yeah. You really want to yeah. see? Right now? Yes. Right Come on, now. go! Come on! It can taste good, but it's not like blow my mind with ex like crazy flavors. Like no, no, it's not supposed to be... It needs, it needs it, something. It just it probably needs salt. Remember the pork stock was like super light on salt. It needs salt. Just and a pepper, little salt and pepper. But it tastes good. Okay. Way to just kinda hmm. <laughs> just Would you like to try it? Look. Yeah. Oh yeah. It tastes like gravy. Well it does. But Rose <laughs> like it might not have blown your mind like uh it's not... like eating chocolate cake for the first time. But I mean, that's homemade gravy. That we is made pretty the pork cool. stock. I know. This is delicious. And it's gonna be pretty stellar. I just love cooking on a wood stove. I love it when you cook on a wood stove. I was gonna, I was gonna correct you actually, but I was like, no, I'll spare him, <gasps> Jeff. <gasps> there it is, fresh ham right out of the smoker. Look at the golden. I guess it's not gold. It's like a deep red. I don't know how to describe food properly. It's kind of glistening. It smells smoky. It smells like applewood. The... Oh man. Juicy ham bits. Meaty deliciousness. And we just made that from a pig. <gasps> oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> you already snitched one. I Wait. Oh, wow. <laughs> hey, that. That's the, she gets less on yeah, hers now. Totally. Okay, well, we got the meat. And we just need some crispy fries. The Get the down. fries! The back down. Yikes. Get the fries! Right. Rose, you better go help with the fries. Mom, what's this for? That's... Hot out of the oil. These even... I mean, you can't hide the fact that these are French fingerlings. No. <laughs> like, they are still purple under there, hey? Hang on. Yeah. Uh, one. Ooh, I got three. They're very nice. Mmm. Are they the most amazing ever? Mm-hmm. Pretty amazing. Oh wow. Crunchy. And yeah, these things are just gonna go from great to but, amazing once they become But they poutine. won't be crunchy anymore. They'll be soggy. Mmm. The, they will remain crunchy, but they will be drenched in gravy and dripping with cheese curds and... Watch this. Watch this. Seasoned with, oh, you're trying the gravy. I think I need to thicken it up a little bit. I think you need some salt. Yeah, thicken it up and bring it over. Mm. Second. We're ready. Sugar We're so up. close. We got the cheese curds. We've never been this close, girls. We have never been this close to poutine. Eat it, eat it, eat it. Oh. <laughs> wow. That was almost life-threatening. It was dripping. That is delicious. Life is good. Hey, we're making our own poutine out of our own homegrown potatoes, out of our own homegrown ham, out of our own homegrown cheese curds, and our own homegrown gravy. This is, uh... Homegrown poutine? Rose. Yes. yes. Did you think 10 years ago when we moved out here that we would be 
doing this? No. No. I don't think he even knew what poutine was 10 years ago. <laughs> mm hmm. And then we do some of the mm -hmm. cheese curds. Mm -hmm. More. More? More. Don't you put the cheese on the bottom? Mm -hmm. No. Okay. I've got the gravy. Pass the gravy. And, okay. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, and the meat. You need more gravy than that. That's good for me. Look at this. Oh my. The smoked ham. I don't even know what to say. Silence. Don't say anything, just eat it. Oh man. This is the world's first poutine made at Tipper Creek. The cheese squeak. Did it? Mm hmm. Oh. See? It's like needed to get Where's hot. There something. you go. No way. Oh, man. <laughs> is it so great? Uh huh. All right, girls, make a plate. Oh, my goodness. A bowl. Wow. I'm not even letting the the cheese melt. Like it's just it's so fresh. Oh wow. I'm hungry. Mm-hmm. The gravy is delicious. It really is. It's like But then you can taste a little bit of smoked ham. Oh the smoked ham! Crispy fries, the cheese. Sarah. Sarah. You nailed the cheese curds. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Mmm. It's squeaking! <laughs> it's like twink, 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 twink. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> oh. Tell me about it, Julia. Is it good? Did we do good? Yes. Christina, what do you think? Oh my. Mm -hmm. This is simply and completely amazing. Mm. I am so proud of our French Canadian heritage. What? I have never been What? I've never been more proud of you guys. Mm. Merci. How much do I put Rose. Rose. Mm. Give me we did it! I totally we did it, girls! Poutine! Oh, baby! Mm. <laughs> oh. Mm. Abigail, give me full review. Like, full, like, food critic review. There is no words. <laughs> <laughs> is it that good? It's really good. It is so good. I don't even know if there's any left. <laughs> Did you run here like I said? <laughs> you, I just heard there was an emergency. <laughs> <laughs> now, Dave, you have had like you had poutine when you were young. Yeah, before it was cool. You're the only one, so I need you to take a center stage at our food critic station here, and like give me the blow by blow. This is homemade everything. <laughs> yeah. Homemade gravy, like really, like we made it from the bones. <laughs> It's homemade potatoes, which we grew ourselves. It's homemade bacon, or no, ham that we just pulled out of the smoker. <gasps> that is still in the smoker! Yeah. Someone go check the smoker! Oh, brother. We forgot it in there. And homemade cheese from Sarah's own milk cow and Sarah's homemade cheese curds. It's delicious. Okay. Yeah. It's fabulous. I want it hotter though. Oh, hotter. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, um, that's sort of our fault. Yeah. I'll tell you what, like individually, mm -hmm. each component is delicious. Okay, so we flip that. 
Right? Oh, but together? Together, it's it's a bit of an overload. It's wow. amazing. Wow. Look, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try and capture the first person experience here. <laughs> just make some chewing sounds. If you ever wanted to know what it was like to be Dave, this is what it's like. You need a much bigger container to be Dave. <laughs> We should make one of those ASMR videos. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I, I, I think we are. <laughs> Some people find this very soothing. Yeah. Mmm. Yeah, it's really good. Wow. Your mouth just like looks so joyful right now. Girls, come look at this. Come look in the... It's just like Dave's mouth. It's like... If you could look up joy in the dictionary, it would have a picture of Dave's mouth right now. Look at that profile too. I feel like you're getting more rugged as you eat the uh, Putin. <laughs> That's it for Putin. We're all gonna pass out now. So we'll we'll catch you next time. And actually, we're not done yet. Rose, what are you making? Breakfast poutine. Breakfast poutine. Fresh skillet of... Okay. Hash browns. Okay. Rose is in the kitchen making some magic. How much do you want? More. Mm -hmm. More? It should kind of fill the plate. No. no. What? That will give you a heart attack. I think you better just cool it on that. <laughs> Oh baby. I'm sure this has been done. Like, but I haven't ever seen it personally. And oh and stop. Stop. You forgot something. No, it goes on top. No. Yes? Uh mm -hmm. that's how we did it last time. I want bacon in the middle and on top. Oh my god. Okay. Continue. <laughs> Breakfast booty. <laughs> and there it is. The definition of hearty. Oh my girl. Girls. Heck, <laughs> we've reached like a new level. This is serious now. I'm being serious. But when when you when you you go off grid, like when you want to homestead or move to the woods, it's kind of to take control and be in charge and, you know, get joy from just making your own food, building your own house, maybe splitting your own firewood. But this is like, this is like a whole new level. This isn't just providing your own food. This is creating food magic. Like we're eating like kings right now. This is the most amazing, like incredibly rich, homemade. Mm. Is it mind blowing? Mm -hmm. I just can't stop looking at it. And the bacon, <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> your hash browns are crispy. Yeah. And a little bit, there's some soft ones. Yeah. And the bacon. Not too crispy that it just falls apart, but it's oh. still a little bit crispy. Yep. And the cheese curds are warm. Yep. And squeaky. No, they're not squeaky. Kind of squeaky. The bacon is... The, the bacon. Gravy. Gravy is sweet and sweet. Mmm. Yeah, it's sweet. Mm. And together, it tastes like poutine. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, like this is every bit as good as dinner poutine. Is that? Yeah. Like, I would actually, like we're eating this kind of like a leftovers, but I feel like we could make poutine just at breakfast. Really? Yeah. I don't know. I am, I'm undecided She's about not gravy sold yet, but on I, my... You're going to be decided really fast, I think. Hmm. It's growing on me. I know. I think... <laughs> I feel like it's amazing. Mm -hmm.
I think we're on a new thing. I'm so glad we did this poutine part two. <laughs> we had no plans of doing this, but it I just, it came to me. It just came to me. I'm just answering the call. I guess. I guess it's time to go. Mm -hmm. What better way? What better way? Death by Putin. 